What is going on, Swoopers? Welcome back to another episode of Swoop Luke. Uh, in this episode, um, we haven't done one of these before, but in celebration of Mother's Day, I thought I'd get mum on to just chat a little bit about uh, her experiences with going to the football with me, uh, football in general, uh, I guess what it's like having, you know, such an amazing son uh, compared to her other son. <laughs> um, and, and yeah, so first, before we sort of jump off w with Mother's Day, um, want to give a shout out to uh, everyone who is a mother figure in someone's life, everyone who's lost a mother figure, uh, whether that be an auntie, a, a grandmother, um, a mum, someone that, you know, a stepmom, whatever it may be, um, because we know how hard Mother's Day is. Mum knows how hard Mother's Day is. Um, losing my grandmother and mum's mum uh, four, four or five years ago now. Um, so Mother's Day is always uh, a little bit hard, but we're not going to sort of talk about that. We're going to go straight into it. So I guess the first sort of thing I want to sort of talk about is what's football like now, like watching it, like with all the stuff that I've been sort of doing, compared to when we sort of used to watch it maybe eight, nine years ago? Oh, well, now it's more um, hands-on, like... Seeing you doing your sweep Luke and that, it never used to be like that before. <laughs> so um, I'm proud to, to see you do what you do when you when we go to the football. Um, and especially seeing all your fans calling <laughs> you, hey, swoop, hey, swoop. It makes me a proud mum. Yeah, no, but um, it's grouse. It's great um, being there, seeing you um, doing what you love best. And yeah, um, I enjoy it. I enjoy it a lot. So... Thank you for the kind words. So what about... I have to, I'm your mum. <laughs> uh, so what about... So I, I said... So I've been saying since I started Swoop five years ago that, you know, I wanted it to start it as a little bit of therapy. So I come on, talk about the game and kind of um, forget about it. So that's... I just want to sort of get my feelings out. And I sort of know the answer to this. But what was I like before I started Swoop and all these videos... If the pies, what was I like after, and I know one story, but what, were the, what was I like during a game, not, and not a win, if, if we lost, what was my, and you can be as honest as, honest as, you, as, honest as you want, it's, it's, a safe, it's a safe space. You used to cry? <laughs> yeah. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Cry, crack, crack it. Crack the shits, um, yeah. yeah. I was you can, say you can swear on here, it's can all I good. Can I say that? Yeah, yeah. All right, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> wasn't sure, wasn't sure. Um, yeah, you were not a happy chappy. My, um, my parents and uh, my husband's parents uh, used to always pray that Collingwood would win <laughs> so he doesn't get upset and uh, have a, you know, bad... A bad, bad weekend. Ex yeah, bad weekend. So you can see. But um, no, he's he's improved a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I was going to say... Still cries, <laughs> but better than what he was before. Um, that one, the, the one story, I don't think I've, I don't think I've told... That, that story about um, Justin, my brother, um, do you, you, remember, you obviously remember it, the one we were, I can't remember what it was, it might have been 2017, Nanda and Nanda were at our house, and Collingwood would, it, might, it would have been 2017, because we were shit in 2017, and we were losing a lot of games, and we were playing Geelong, and we were watching the game. Can you go? So, can you tell, can you tell this? Is can that the one story? where... You were just about to win the game and uh, Justin switched yeah, off tell, the tell television. Yeah, tell, tell the story. Uh, tell the story and exactly what happened. Um, <laughs> as much as I can remember it. Um, yeah, as Lukey was saying, we were watching um, the game at our house and my parents were there and um, and Justin, as as he does, always um, picks Stare, on pi yeah, Younger picks brother on picking him, on me, staring me up. Staring him up. Um, doesn't he switch off the TV? At the time that they're going to kick the last goal and win. And my mum just cracked it. Yeah, but before Nanda cracked it, what what did I do? Oh, sorry, yeah. <laughs> he cried. He was yelling at Justin. Yeah. Um, he was all over the shop. So, yeah. And my mum just wouldn't stop ringing him. After she got home, she was ringing him. Is he all right? Is he going to be okay? Is... She was yelling at Justin as well because yeah, he that's was right, laughing. He, yeah, Justin just didn't even think twice about I just, it. I think, does Justin have that video? Did Justin record that? 
Ooh, if we I can, if I can find the, I think I, I feel like that's something that Justin would have done. He might have recorded it. If I can find the footage, <laughs> it's very incriminating footage. But if I can find it, I'll, I'll post it. But yeah, that yeah. was, um, yeah, that was crazy. But Nunna used to, and Nunna and Nunnu on 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 Dad's side, they they do it as well. But no, I, I specifically remember Nunna Carmen all the time. Whenever we lost, she'd call me up, apologize, <laughs> yeah. say sorry that you guys lost. lost yeah. Um, <laughs> she like knew. she had a part of it, but. Uh, no, nah, it was um, it was good. It was good. So, I guess what would what would be your earliest? So we we didn't grow up like a traditional football family. Um, mm-hmm. Neither you nor dad sort of played, went to games, followed it, or, or whatever. That that that's what happens when you sort no. of immigrant parents and stuff coming in. But my parents uh, and my dad was more soccer. Soccer, yeah, yeah that's yeah. what I mean. Yeah, so, so he, European yeah, football, yeah, European and stuff like football. That. So what would um, what would be your earliest w- without me? What would be your earliest footballing memory? Did you know of it? Or? Yeah, my, my brothers. Oh, well, Uncle, my Mario. Brother, Uncle Mario. Uncle yep. Mario. Um, he loves the Saints. Oh, I like you've seen, him, tomorrow, just you've like, seen him on. Yep. Yep. Remember just like Luke, yep. he loves uh, Collingwood. And um, yeah, my brother, t- uh, my other brother used to um, love Carlton. And my older brother, Phil, loves uh, Hawthorne. And yeah, and they were just always watching it at home and stuff. But obviously, never, us as girls never yeah. followed anything and never, you never done went. Anything. Never went. No, to a game never went then. to a game. Never went to a game. But then when you guys started doing Auskick, and yep. that's when we sort of got into doing football. Yeah. And just following it up from there. But I think it was mainly you, because Justin. Sorry, Justin, but you did sit on the bench a lot. <laughs> um, and that's why he doesn't like football <laughs> as much as this one does. But Luke, he just had a passion. Um, didn't care that um, the other guys were going to rip his head off or <laughs> he would just go in, do what he done best and, and just enjoy the game. So and he how was many, always... And how many times did you want to jump the fence because they were picking on me for being small? Well, I wasn't going to say anything, but <laughs> yes. A, a few times, a few times, but neither could I jump the fence because the fence would come up the hill for me. So it was a bit difficult. So you see where he gets that from. So, but yeah, it's um, it was just in his blood. He just loved the game. He's always even did um, indoor football and and fun. the guys were always 10 times bigger than Luke. And But he still went in, still headstrong and... Mm. Um, that's why I hardly went because I was always scared <laughs> that he was uh, gonna get injured, and he got injured a few times. But yeah, but he's just he's just in it, and he just loves it. Loves and I it. love you for <laughs> thanks, mum. Being who you are. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so well, I hope that's not gonna get him into trouble. Nah. <laughs> so you love coming to the football now. You actually might love it more than dad. I feel <laughs> always breaking him to try and get tickets. So I think we're gonna get you a, a membership next year. Um, but the, the last game you came to was the Carlton game. Yep. Um, do you want to tell us a little bit about that? So it was a close game. The last game, we try to get you to, to most games when, when we can, when we can, when we can buy tickets, but, um, what did, how was that Carlton game for you? <laughs> well, funny enough, cause of the Carlton game, um, friends at work, they're all Carlton supporters and we're Collingwood supporters. So we had a bit of a, you know. <laughs> Uh, thing going on but um, going to the game and knowing how much the rivals are with Carlton and Collingwood um, and knowing how much Luke would love obviously Collingwood (laughs) to win Um, yeah it was and the passion and seeing everybody there at the ground and all the kids and it's just it's 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 a great atmosphere Um, everybody having a banter here and there and you know it's, it's just a great atmosphere. It's great to go, but does it kill you? Your heart <laughs> is in your mouth. It's just like, are they going to get a goal? Is he going to get yeah. hurt? You know, like, uh, what's he going to do and everything like that. But no, I just enjoyed it. But those last... Those last couple of minutes, yeah. Those or last couple of minutes. And, and the last couple of seconds, yeah. And not that, but hearing the guys, uh, Luke and his, and his dad, Charlie, um, 90 seconds to go. Oh, 60 the, seconds like the, to go. The countdown, yeah, countdown. The count, and you're thinking, going. please, don't get another goal <laughs> for the other team, obviously. Um, yeah, so, um, but no, and then everybody singing the the club song and that. Oh, it was, it's amazing. Yeah, it's amazing. It's a good, it's a good, yeah, it's a good, it's good little community as well. And look, if we do lose, occasionally. <laughs> um, okay, everyone goes with a sad face, but... 
they pick themselves up and they cheer them on 100%. for the next for the next um for the next match and that's the yeah. way it goes you know you win some you lose some exactly who's your favorite player i've got more than one go who's who's a couple who's a couple then <laughs> okay i've got my check he's on my list <laughs> elliot <laughs> i like bobby ash johnson um there's maynard I'm just trying to think as um, I'm just seeing their faces. I know I'm my faces, <laughs> but hardly names. So, so I have to just learn a bit more. You said Majek for the first one. So would he be your favourite player? Majek? Majek, yes. All right. Majek, he I'll see what I can do. I'll see if I can hook you guys up. Oh, and Bobby as well. And Bobby. Actually, <laughs> actually Majek um, uh, owns, a, owns a cafe in Hawthorne called Whiplash. We should go. You might see him. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Ba bagels and stuff. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, not sponsored, Done. but... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Good. Done. laughs> All right. So we got a I'm couple. I'm keeping you up to that. Yeah, we'll do it. Uh, we got a couple of paying. questions. <laughs> no, no, he I'll is. pay. I'll pay my share. He is. <laughs> we got a couple of questions um, here. So, um, oh, Mally Bean asked your earliest Collingwood memory. Oh, what would be your earliest Collingwood memory? So yourself. Yeah. Yeah, when you used to. To, to go for Collingwood and you know we used to watch it on TV or you know just you having the like I said just the passion just for the football, the football. and the and the team and obviously you you've, yeah you've really worked up to doing what you would love to do sweetheart um, oh my that's not sweet Anzo two nine zero four says what was Swoop like when he was younger so not fully footy related no no but, but what was I like when I was young, and again, you can be as open and honest no, as no, no, you No, 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 he was a good kid. <laughs> he was a good kid. Yes, we had the, he'd done his own thing, and I had, because I've got a bit of a hard head, um, but no, he was a good kid. I've had both of them. No, they're both good kids. Um, Justice. Yes, you did. Um, but this one, he never, with his gaming and all that sort of stuff, everything was too easy for him. An earliest memory of him, in, when he was three years old, we bought him um, a Nintendo, I think that was out mm -hmm. then, and we got him this game that was for three-year-olds, and he's just gone, doo -doo 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 -doo, played it, and he goes, Mum, this is for babies, the three-year-olds. <laughs> I don't remember, know, I don't remember that. Yeah, oh, he was, shit. yeah. He goes, this is for babies. Fuck, I don't remember. Yeah, so. She's um, from three. Yeah, so whatever the latest one was then, yeah. yeah. Oh, you God. tell Dad, you tell Dad. Yeah, yeah you said, no, Mum, this is for babies. <laughs> so, but no, so he always loved doing all that sort of stuff. So, yeah. yeah. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah. Um, Helen and Fam says, <laughs> in jov jovially, who is your favourite child? <laughs> um, oh, it's taking too long to answer, so it must be me and not Justin. Nah. <laughs> I love them both. So. I had to say, no, I don't love either one more than the other. They've both got their different qualities. They've both got um, uh, Luke. Well, both of them are very. Uh, they're, they're very empathetic. They're very kind. They they help um, when needed. They especially when I'm not doing well um, or I'm sick or whatever. Um, they're always there for me. So. I can't spot anything different. Finally, Carrot Gold says, how did you comfort Luke after the 2018 Grand Final? So you remember we watched it um, at, that... uh, when we went to, we had those blow up uh, fucking couches. Oh yes, that was grouse. That. that that was, the, we, so we went to did the- Did you send them photos of that, how we no, were? No, so we went to the, um, I'll, I'll find some. We went to the uh, the live site for 2018 because we couldn't get it. Yeah. Um, and yeah, what was, what do you remember it? Yeah, of course I what do. Was, what was that, what was that like? Oh, that was ah, oh, that was intense. That was intense. That was just like when we played um, St Kilda and we came yeah. to draw, and then we had to go watch Back. it again. Yeah, yeah, yeah at, at Fed Square. We were at Fed Square. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we're well, at, I was right. Yeah. Yeah, we're I'm at not Fed, that old. Yet. Yeah, we're at, Fed, we're at Fed Square in 2010. Not for the replay, for the for the first, first one. one. Yeah. Then the last set at, at 2018. Yeah, that yeah. was that was. I don't think so. When it sort of ended uh, um we kind of just it was just like you could hear a pin drop yeah right? it was oh it was crazy and i think i do have some photos around um there was a lot of people yeah. like heaps 
and we got bagged because we had these <laughs> grouse, grouse yeah, we blow, had blow up, up chairs. Blow up, blow up chairs. Yeah. Oh, they were awesome. Um, we bought heaps and all our, um, um, my son's, um, not Lukey's, but uh, Justin's friends came with us because mm. they were Collingwood supporters as well. You know, we did the picnic thing and mm. everything. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Um, and everyone, the atmosphere was beautiful. It was great. But then at the end, it was like, yeah. what yeah. the hell happened here? Yeah, it was pretty cool. We were devastated. Mm. We were devastated. I remember I got home, ordered lots of, Ma lot, ordered lots of McDonald's, went into bed, ate and, and cried. <laughs> That's very good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ate, and, <laughs> ate and cried. But then we had the... So I went with Dad to the grand, grand final, and you were the first person that called me afterwards. Mm. How would you feel watching that game and watching the boys win, you know, it, it was 13 years since our last premiership. Wow. Wow, that's a long time ago. <laughs> a long time ago. But I'm only getting from what um, I remember from Luke. Uh, even though we watched the game from home. Um, I mean, sorry, I watched the game with my uh, in-laws from home. Um, it was amazing. These mm. guys came back. Bloody, like they had won <laughs> bloody Tats Lotto and stuff. Um, it was good to see that a team that Lukey loved, and it's, I think it's more got to do with uh, the feelings you have for your for your child, for your child, your children, um, what they feel, you feel. It's it's just what mm. it is to be a mother. Yeah. Um, if you're sad, we're sad. Yeah. If you're happy, we're happy. If, you know, it, and that's just what it is. You know, we we just do what we can as a mum. Yeah. And try and bring yous up when we can and try and bring you down <laughs> when you're, you, you think you're a bit up, especially with this uh, ear, ear thing that we do. Um, but no, but um, no, that's... Being a mum is amazing. Being a mother figure is amazing and... Um, you know, I just, I don't know what to say. I just love you. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of Justin. I'm proud of what he does. I'm proud of, um, you know, all my nieces and nephews. Um, I love all of them all the same. But, you know, seeing you, Luke, do what you do best, that's more than, than I can um, ask for. Thank so, you. And I love you. I love you too, Mum. Um, and... <laughs> Oh, you know what would have been good if I had flowers to give you, but that's all right. <laughs> I'll go on okay. Sunday. On Sunday, I'll do. No, um, don't need to. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I think, yeah, so I, I wanted to just come on and I guess, you know, do something that we, we haven't done on, on this channel before and, and kind of etch this in, in sort of history, I, I guess, and, and on, on the channel so we can always sort of look, look back at it even when, you know, Swoop sort of stops. But yeah, I guess um, without your support, I, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing now. It's been a hard, long five years. It's been crazy with lots of personal stuff. Um, yeah, even like the swoop stuff and, you know, where there were times where I just sort of wanted to, um, you know, hit a, hit a wall, want to sort of give, give wanted to sort of give it up. And um, yeah, I guess, you know, dad as well, but we're not talking about dad now. So, um, but <laughs> dad, dad's your rock too. Don't yeah. you worry about no, he that. Is, he is, but he's you not know, your mother, but, but you, he's always there. Yeah. You, um, I think we're very, we're very similar with the way that we think and like our feelings and stuff. We, mm -hmm. we vibe a little bit, um, like more, more of a, more like, more like minded with that, that sort of, you know, those feelings and stuff. So, you know, you're someone that I, I definitely look up to to sort of keep pushing on and stuff. And I remember, um, so when me and dad went to watch um, Take the Steps, so we went to the premiere, um, Craig McRae came over, said hi, said, hey, how you going? Uh, nice, nicest guy. Um, and he said, um, he's like, oh, because I'm introducing to dad. And he's like, oh, does, does Luke get his, um, not charm, what did he say? He's... He's like empathy and, and, you know, positivity from you. And we both sort of said, nah, we, he probably gets it from mum the most. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, well, that's nice you to know. know. Um, that's nice so you've know. instilled, I feel, you've instilled some really great 
and nice traits in me. Um, yeah, and it's not always easy, but it's I do. It's not easy as a mum <laughs> either. Yeah, I know. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I do. I do love you a lot. Um, and I love you. And yeah, I just wanted to get you on the channel and. I hope I didn't embarrass you. <laughs> no, 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 it's all good. And I love you so much. I love okay? you too. Oh, my baby. And, uh, yes. you know, hopefully we can win that premiership again this year. I hope so. Um, but, yeah, look, so to the mums out there, the mother figures out there, um, and anything in between, happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's um, Day. Have the best time. Get spoiled. Enjoy yourself. Uh, and, yeah, we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>